Okay, I'm going to do a very quick run-through on how to create a document that looks just like this one using the Muse Edit program. I've done the long version of this tutorial in class, and this will be the short version. I'll begin by uh, swapping my cursor from this musical note style to the arrow. I'll close this because we don't need it. And I'm going to select all of these lines and delete them and start all over. Okay, begin by typing the title. This old man. And I'm going to change the font size. To change the font size, put your cursor on the line you want to change. Choose font. Make the changes you wish to make. And hit OK. I'm going to hit return to insert a new text line and type in some of the song information. Like this one will be arranged by me, and it is a folk tune from England. Uh, but I don't want the size of the font to be the same as the title, so I'm going to take away the bold and make it a bit smaller and say OK. Good enough. I'm going to space down again, adding one more text line. Then it's time to insert the chord symbols. Remember, these are the icons or the buttons for inserting. You can also do it through the Insert menu. I'd like to insert next a chord line. And to insert a chord, type the letter name of the chord you'd like to enter. In this case, an F chord. I've typed an F. You see the F up here right there. So click OK, and you get your chord symbol. Next, I'd like to add a treble line. So I'm going to click on the treble staff here, or I could go to insert and add a treble staff. There it is. That's all I'm going to do with that for now. Next, add a text line. I can click on the text button right here, or go to insert and choose text line. And right away, I'm going to type in the first line of text. This old man, comma, he played one. Keep in mind what I said about um, using proper grammar and punctuation and such when you're writing lyrics in a song. It's very important. The last thing we're to do is to insert the time signature and key signature. To do so, use your control button and your arrow keys to move around your document until you're on the treble staff. Go to the front of the treble staff with your caret there. Insert the time signature excuse me, the key signature first. We're going to F major. So if I click here and move down to F, click OK, and then insert the time signature. And we're going to be in 2-4, so I'm going to click down until this becomes a 2. Say OK, and you're done. This concludes this tutorial. Good luck.